Do you want to know the secret? Come closer. Closer. TRT, Royal Medical Center, unboxing. <laughs> Again, with another edition of Royal Medical Center TRT unboxing. I swear I called this Meathead Christmas before. This is like Meathead Christmas. Um, although, and we are going to open this, totally go through this. Um, I know everybody loves it, like loves to see these things get opened up and it is exciting, mostly for me because I get to use the, the goodies inside. But uh, I do actually have some things, I, I wrote down some thoughts that I did want to share um, since it's been a couple months since I've updated you guys, but I'm feeling great feeling great and I wanted to just be really fair and honest to like this whole experience and give like my true testimonial you know and be a little bit more um you know honest and up front look at this so already I love I love how like thorough they are with all of the literature they include all pamphlets the packaging it's always just the bomb it's just so amazing I love it um and then again, so nicely and neatly, nicely, neatly shipped. Um, so we're going to go through this here shortly. But um, a couple things I wanted to, I made note that I wanted to kind of add uh, as far as where I'm at currently, uh, physically, uh, you know, body weight, muscle strength, all those good sort of updates that a lot of people are interested in. Uh, but also I just celebrated like last week, as at the time I'm recording this anyway, my 39th birthday. So here we are, man. This is like, you know, a year and a half on uh, TRT. And uh, man, I have never felt better. <laughs> and I've also had the most traumatic injuries of my whole life within this span. So I always tell people like, I cannot imagine what my life would have been without this. Um, so that was kind of the first note. I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. So where am I at currently physically? Uh, six foot one. My weight is at 182 pounds fasted this morning. My body fat percentage has not been tested recently. However, you can still visibly see my top four abs. Uh, I'm slacking off a little. Like normally it's like forever six pack. Um, like I have that confidence going. And, you know, I, I don't know. I don't know if it was because my birthday and the cake and ice cream um, or just travel, life, whatever. But um, yeah, I'm a little puffy, but like I'm still in like striking distance of six pack. I'm happy. Uh, you know, I'm not complaining at all. Uh, my lifts in the gym are steadily increasing month over month. Now, again, I'm rehabbing from two huge injuries. I broke my neck last year, had that fused. And then right after being cleared from the doctor to begin subsequent weight training, like literally got cleared on a Monday, seven days later, like the following Monday or Sunday, actually six days later, my bicep ruptured, totally ripped off the bone, had to have that surgically repaired. Um, put back to the bone too. So I got some additional metal there as well. So then I had to rehab that. And I did a lot of that with the TENS unit and bands, a lot of that good stuff. Um, so I've had some major setbacks, but with that, my body fat has not ballooned. Um, you know, I've been able to maintain all of the existing muscle I had, which is pretty awesome. You know, pretty, pretty awesome. You know, you work so hard to gain a pound of muscle. It's like just knowing that you can keep your hormones within like, you know, their prime, sort of like places they need to be from a level perspective and like you can actually you know cut out some of the harder work by just leveraging science so that's kind of neat that led me to the second topic again we're going to go over all these goodies kind of tease you a little bit that i made a note that i want to talk over mental health you know mental health i always neglect to talk about this you know but if you're someone like me and i've been open you know i've been open obviously if you're familiar with stigma my IG, Facebook, I'm constantly posting things about kind of positive mental health messages and stuff um, because I struggle, right? Um, but to that end, man, I, I was really reflecting on this recently and, and I made a note. I said, I want to share this in the next video. If I'm being honest, if I'm being like giving a testimonial and a real review and all this, having my hormones uh, regularly, my blood drawn, right? And tested and analyzed by the, these doctors, right? These specialists. 
um, endocrinologist, right? Um, has really changed my life. Like if you're someone like me and struggles with, uh, I'll just say positive mental health, right? Uh, the difference of having your estrogen out of whack or your testosterone low is very meaningful. And uh, working with a partner like Royal Medical Center, I know, I know has like saved me from myself a little bit. You know, it's definitely helped keep, I'll just say some anger management issues in check, but more over depression, because that's how all that manifested. Anyway, I haven't been as sad, you know, and, you know, they said it would help, you know, it helped with your overall well-being, you know, especially from where I was. I was in such a deficit and I needed some help, you know, I was out of whack, you know, and just having that ongoingly tested, monitored, and we've made adjustments along the way. You know, I've shared that before, you know, my estrogen was really high at one point, so we had to change the medicine, the, the dosage, not the frequency. Um, and there's other things we've had to do as well. So, you know, in light of the injuries and stuff. So th they've been very helpful. But I, I did want to make a note of that and share, you know, that this has helped my overall well-being. And like, and again, if you're someone like me that kind of, you know, has a hard go about it sometimes. And, you know, you don't naturally just wake up feeling like it's your day, you know. Something like this, in my opinion, will really, could potentially really, really help you. You know, if you take it the way your doctor prescribes it. You're gonna feel better every month you know and you're gonna look better and i know that's like vain you know but it's not you know you look better you feel better that's real you want your skin to be better you want your hair to be better you want your muscles to feel more tone right who doesn't and especially if you're someone that works out you know if you're working at that oh my gosh keep your hormones in check you're constantly depleting yourself you know like redlining you just get some help this is natural science this is available it's so easy they have online consults telemedicine they ship it just like this so night and neat so so let's get into this here we go let's get into the goodies the treasure box right so here we are i have my anastrozole so this is my estrogen medicine let's see what we have it's a one milligram tablet i'm taking by mouth on my injection days so easy enough they always give you and again very thoughtful they always give you just the right amount of syringes for the prescribed medicine uh, to help you draw right from your bottle and they give you a shorter smaller tip that you can exchange that with sterile tip and then when you inject with a new fresh tip too so you don't have to reuse tips whatsoever even just to draw it out uh, from the vial itself so so thoughtful they also give additional syringe needles again the appropriate amount prescription for the other medicine in here which is uh for really to help your testes to continue so here's the thing right let's just let's just go through it right this helps so when you give your body testosterone exogenously right from a foreign substance thing your body isn't producing it it's from the outside coming in that's what this testosterone is right uh your test your testes right your gonads they're gonna stop producing they're gonna turn off the function to produce testosterone it's gonna say hey we already got that that bucket's getting filled over here so don't make any more we're good we're satisfied you don't want to shut that off too long because then your body isn't going to have the signal turned back on right that's that's real that's a real real probability let's just say so in order to circumvent that and not risk that side effect that likely side effect while taking your testosterone i also have the injectable um and i'm going to spell this because i was i called this the wrong name in the last video that's why i'm probably stumbling a little right now because i want to be exact about this i formally called it hcg they don't prescribe hcg anymore it's not hcg however this medicine which i'm going to spell for you it, it does the same function again it allows my testes not to shut off allows them to maintain their size so they don't shrink let's just talk about it helps my sperm and ejaculate stay consistent and full again not watery or thin um it just helps keeping everything functioning the way it should now what am i talking about it's not hcg i'm gonna spell it for you okay because again i'm gonna i'm gonna butcher it and i want to do this the right way so it is G O N A D O R E L I N. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do it. But but it's a five milliliter vial. I inject. Let's see here. Two hundred uh, mcgs. Two hundred mcgs twice a week, and it's in my belly. That's what those little insulin insulin syringes were for. So I have my testosterone, I have two bottles of this medicine, which I will spell for you again to help your testes from shutting off, right? G-O-N-A-D-O-R-E-L-I-N. Okay, five milliliter vial. 
As far as the testosterone goes, it is testosterone cypionate, 200 milligrams once a week. Okay, so, so yeah, so that's what we got there. Um, again, we have our Nastrozole. I take this in the days I take my injection and just the right amount of syringes to go along with uh, this next, let's see here, five weeks, right? Five, six weeks. So thank you again for watching. Again, always hit me below with any questions you have. I'm, I'm always surprised. Sometimes I get hit with a question. I'm like, you know what? I never thought of that. And that's a pretty good question. Like it may feel like it was obvious to me. I'm like, how did I miss that? You know, so please feel free to ask questions. I'm distracting myself with this box. I'll stop. Thank you again for watching. All the information below to contact Royal Medical Center is there, including a discount code. Use it, guys. It's up to like $300 off your testing. Um, again, this is a, this is really an awesome service. You know, hopefully I've been able to address some of your questions already through this video. If you have any more, hit me below. Make sure to hit the like, subscribe, ring the bell. Thank you so much for watching.